How to join or add a computer to home group in Windows 7. Here's how. 1. If you have not already, make sure that all PCs that are already in the home group you want to join are turned on and not asleep. 2. Make sure to synchronize the clocks on all computers that will be part of the home network so that they are showing the correct date and time. If the clocks are not synchronized, the home group feature will not work. 3. Be sure that you have already created a home group on another computer on your home network to be able to add this computer to that home group. 4. If you are using a wireless network through a wireless router, then check to make sure that say for example WLAN partition, D-Link, or enable wireless isolation, Netgear, are unchecked in the router's wireless settings. When it is enabled, checked, it prevents wireless devices from being able to see and communicate with each other. See screenshots below. Note, the screenshots below are from AD Link the IR855, left, and Netgear WNDR3800, right. Wireless Router You will need to look at your router's manual for how with it. 5. Make sure that the computer is set to have a home network location type. 6. Open the Control Panel, Icons View, and click on the Network and Sharing Center icon. A. Click on the Change Adapter Settings link. B. Right-click on your network connection adapter, and click on Properties. If prompted by UAC, then click on Yes. Make sure that the items below are checked, and click on OK. Note Note Sometimes the registry setting does not get updated even though you enable IPv6 via the GUI interface here. You can check the setting in the registry, regedit, by going to the key location below, hkey underscore local underscore machine system current control set services tzip6 parameters. In the right pane, right click on disabled components and select modify. Make sure the value is set to zero. File and printer sharing for Microsoft Networks. Internet Protocol Version 6, TCP IPv6, Internet Protocol Version 4, TCP IPv4, C. Click on the back arrow button, left arrow, in Network Connections to return to the Network and Sharing Center. D. Click on the Change Advanced Sharing Settings link. E. Make sure that the Home or Work, Current Profile, Settings for network discovery, file sharing, and home group connections are set as they are below for the ones pointed out with the red arrows. Then click on Save Changes. If prompted by UAC, then click on Yes. 7. In the Network and Sharing Center, click on the Choose Home Group and Sharing Options link. 8. Click on the Join Now button. Note, sometimes it may take a moment to detect the other computer on the home network. If a home group does not already exist, already created, on your home network, then Windows 7 will ask if you would like to create a home group instead of joining a new one. 9. Select, Check what libraries and printers that you want to share from this computer with any other computer that joins this home group, then click on Next. 10. Type in the home group password of the created home group that you want to join or add the computer, 2, then click on Next. Note, the password is case sensitive, so be sure to type it in correctly. 11. After a few seconds, this computer has been joined to the home group. Click on Finish. 
Note, if you are having problems joining the home group, then double check everything above to make sure it is correct and try the troubleshooting link in the failure notice. 12. Close the home group window. 13. If you open Windows Explorer and click on Home Group in the navigation pane, you will now see the other joined computers that are online listed in your home group. That's it. Shun.